All right. Well, I want to show this. Uh, playing the new War Within. Uh, we're inside the first dungeon here, actually. Uh, looks like we're going to be able to fly, which is kind of cool. Um, and then also we got this infused fire honey mead, which is like a uh, last stand kind of a thing. So if I receive fatal damage, it gives me a huge shield, and it gives me 4,000 primary stat. So uh, the only thing is I can only use it in the Kazogar, but uh, pretty useful. Or if it works inside the dungeon, actually. I don't know if I can actually take enough damage for it to actually happen. But we might find out. I'm in a dungeon. These are all NPCs. We would have never known. Other than they talk. <laughs> I will deactivate Goran myself with this sacrifice. It's actually really cool because he's a. Uh... I guess got lore or in his uh, character. So this is actually kind of fun. Let's pull everything. We finally get into a boss. This guy's just getting destroyed. Does corruption damage on the floor? Does she think you the Lich King or something? Like I literally have the same abilities as Lich King. <laughs> uh. The storm right away. Okay, I'm following you. Are you gonna follow me? Okay. Follow. All right, you guys just teleport down here. Sick. That's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna pull all this stuff. Will you? And you? Piss off my tank. <laughs> See if we can. Oh, uh oh, my tank's dying. <laughs> the tank's dying. Uh oh. No, the tank's dead, I think. Res him. Be res. Be res. Where is he? Where's my tank? Is he a shot? What? Can I be res him? Oh, Pete Res worked. Are you guys coming? Let's go, boys. Oh, 
Is it alright or just... Dungeon, huh? Neat. I didn't get any loot. There's how you get out. Just looking right at it. What the heck is going on? <laughs> no. Alright. Not bad, not bad. I really don't mind that being able to do it with NPCs, honestly. I'm probably queue it for a regular dungeon later. I just want to get to the story campaign right now. You know, that thing's racking and rolling. There's a lot to do. Just in the car. This quest is kind of cool. Let me uh, climb this ladder real quick. I'll grab the rope. Turn it down. We're stringing kegs. Flatten fuses. What? Wait, we're blowing up a meadery? But why? Oh, because the Nerubians are coming for the mead? Man, that shit sucks. Keep this one right. Set the bait. Yeah, well, I'm supposed to throw it. That makes sense, right? I don't want to go down there. I'm pretty sure it's like having an interesting integration. Like I should have to a barrier. That's pretty nice. Even though I don't take that much damage. I wanna look cool. I wanna look sexy. Yeah, uh, I'm invisible. What's going on? I'm just a weapon. This is a tower defense game? Cause it's kinda cool. Oh, I didn't know there was a timer. Because we're screwed now, boys. Can I shoot all the way? Oh, look at that. What? I messed up? Oh, shoot. Alrighty, dude. Let's see what you can do. Pilgrim. Barely look that high. Come on, kaboom. He's going to be okay, right? You're one of these people that ride around on these big ass mounts. I hate you. I'm just thirsty for attention. But for unknown reasons, <laughs> I'm still invisible. Um, but if you come in here, you can get a free 32 slot bag of Rooney. You want to press uh, your blue. And then orange, and then oyster, and then mango, and then go down here. There you go. 
34 slot bag of Rooney. Do I, uh, how do I swap my bag out? Oh, it binds to me. Well, oh well. Now I have way too much bag space. Holy cows. Oh no, a scary dark chest. So scary. Okay, I sold that. Oh, look at that. That's actually kind of cool. That thing's way cool. Oh, set favorite. I like it. I don't use battle pets, but that guy looks pretty cool. He said, Candle King's crazy, man. Leave no candle behind. Dude, this guy's kind of sick. <laughs> that was pretty good. That was pretty good. Oh, I gotta fight this guy. Okay. That's scuffed. I'm supposed to do what now? The music and the sound is great. This guy thinks he's tough stuff over here, dude. That you gonna root me, huh? Are you just gonna run away? What? Come on. Uh-oh. There we go. One of those killed me earlier. <laughs> yeah, for uh, whoever did the music, killed it. Some Lord of the Rings Gondor music right here, baby. That's what we like to hear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I shouldn't say that. This guy's level 80. I'm screwed. We gotta be all sneaky deaky like. It's Waximus. Waximus Primus. Dude, this model is amazing. This model is fantastic. You're not playing mine without the music on. You're doing it wrong. So, uh, so far this has been pretty much the experience playing the new expansion. <laughs> it's been maintenance the first day, maintenance the second day. Oh, and then not to mention the four days we're not able to play it because we didn't spend an extra $40. A lot of people are mad about that. The only, uh, pros that, uh, we could kind of muster up 
with the early access is that it does provide a smoother launch. And I'm saying that, <laughs> I'm saying that with like a grain of salt because I don't know, maybe I felt like Shadowlands really wasn't that bad of a launch, in my opinion. I don't think that I don't, I don't remember if they had early access for Shadowlands either, but yeah. <laughs> Once the game's actually being able to be played, they're like, yeah, no, uh, maintenance, sorry, guys, you can't play. And then also, the buff that uh, everybody else had for the past four days <laughs> before you were able to play, we're going to nerf that buff for your experience rate so that you can't have that. So that's just uh, that's just another burn to the players, Blizzard. Um, but other than that, the experience so far has been... In my opinion, enjoyable. I've been having fun, but I don't know. I've been optimistic, I guess. And as well as not getting my hopes up for anything extraordinary, because I know I can just go back and play Season of Discovery. Um, but so far, it's been really fun. The story has been okay. Um, some of the characters are kind of meh, uh, especially uh, Drogon, Dorgan, the the one dwarf without a beard. Why do you guys not give that guy a beard? Like, what? He's a dwarf. Like, give him a beard, man. <laughs> He's walking over there baby-faced. Give that man a beard and make him sound like a dwarf. The rest of everybody else sounds like a dwarf, and he's like, Oh, hello. Welcome. Like, <laughs> I just... <laughs> it's so... I don't know. It's, like, off-putting. But, uh... The, the chick without an arm, she's pretty cool. Um, the last zone is the coolest zone, and honestly, the, uh, what is it? Oh yeah, the, mu the music is really great. The dungeons are pretty fun. I like the follower dungeons. I like the delves. Um, yeah, I really, I guess mostly I like flying around and just discovering the little cool things and I don't know. So many people just want to hate wow just to hate wow because i don't know maybe it's a uh, self-expression yeah uh other than these few things uh the expansion has been uh, pretty pretty good though and i would recommend trying it if you like wow if you're new to the game uh good luck there's a there's so much stuff in the game that it's even it's not even a lot for me for somebody that's played the game for 20 years there's like so much stuff I've missed in between. So it's like, eh, you know, whatever. And then there's a lot of stuff that's like, oh, I didn't even know that existed <laughs> at the same time. So it's it's really like getting into a whole nother universe either way. Yeah, those are my two cents.